What's up, Caesar? This is a YouTuber from Carson City. We're gonna do a vlog today uh, on his car, and he's gonna get to ride in the GTR. So, <laughs> Caesar, uh, for you guys on uh, Instagram, uh, Caesar.411? Yeah. What does that mean? Um, I just thought four and then 11 was for Neymar, the soccer player. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. So you like soccer? Yeah. You play soccer? Uh, I used to. Nice. Not no more. So you guys know what time it is? It's the driveway test with Luke Caesar, 411. Gotta remember, can you can head over here. Let's go. There you go. Is that good? Uh, see if you can park it straight. Just be careful when you go forward. Don't go too forward. Eh? Despacito, despacito. Well, he did rub, guys. Luckily for him, he has a flexible bumper. All right, guys, so we're out here with Caesar.411 on Instagram. Go ahead and follow him on there. So, Caesar, how old are you? Uh, 15. So, you already drive? Yes. Man, you're pretty young to be driving. Yeah, I bought this car at age 14, actually. Um, so, so Caesar's very young, guys, and, um, you know, he's, he was 14 when he got this car, like he was saying. He's 15 now. And for me, you know, I mean, let's just be honest, we know He's told you guys on the videos, you know, he doesn't even have his license. So, but that's pretty cool to meet, you know, somebody this young to know that he has a car like this. So how were you able to uh, buy a car like this? You know, you're very young. So how'd you do it? So how I got this car, my dad bought me a Yamaha Raptor 250, but I started off with the Chinese quad and he sold it. And then from there, I started to help my mom and stuff work and he actually gave me that money from the quad so from there i was saving up and i used to buy dirt bikes and selling them so 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 the craigslist hustle right yeah yeah, yeah. damn and then gauge, that's pretty good from there when i bought this car i still had extra money so i decided to pay my dad back for the first quad i bought the chinese so do you guys hear that though for you guys that are young and you guys are getting started i mean he went out there. He really something. He really wanted a car like this, and, and he hustled. He he worked for it, and, and he earned it. So this car was not given to him by his parents. He had to work for it. Why an Integra? Why an Integra versus uh, anything else out there? Uh, well, first of all, because of the Fast and Furious. I think it was the first one where that Red Integra was going against Paul Walker and Dominic Toretto. You know what scene it is, Jarul, where he screams out uh, Monica. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> And also because uh, <laughs> my dad used to own an Integra, um, it was pretty clean and also an LS. Nice. So from there, I kind of wanted the Integra. So what year is uh, this Integra? Uh, 1998. And um, LS. so on the side here, uh, we see the wheels. That Again, there's the Instagram guys. Uh, what kind of wheels are these, Caesar? Uh, J and C wheels. So are those easy wheels to get? I mean, they're kind of rare? Or? Uh, no, I pretty... I don't know. I see them a lot. But you like them though. You bought them yeah, brand new. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much? How much were the the uh, wheels? Five hundred. Five hundred bucks. Wheels are these? I decided to go with one ninety five fifty fittings because I think sixteens. I would. I'm. I was still planning on going lower, but I'm probably gonna sell this car. So you're gonna sell the car? Yes. So and the car's lower too, right? What does yeah. it have? The coilovers or springs? Uh, coilovers. Type one coil. Did you do that yourself? No, my dad helped me. Okay, so you guys lowered it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Do you have a video on that? Uh, yes, I do. There you go, guys. So check out, uh, what's your uh, your YouTube name, actually, when they look you up on YouTube? At Caesar. Same too. thing? Yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. And uh, he has 1,300 subscribers, right? Yes. So, and he barely got started. He, he's been on YouTube for like four months. Yeah. 
So that's pretty good, pretty solid. This is a, what the, what's the name of this color? Do you know Caesar? Uh, no. No. Okay. And then I seen that you just posted a video on installing these. What what are these? Uh, type one. No, top one motors winglets. They're supposed to go up here, but I decided to run them down here. It looks nice. It's pretty clean. And then um, you have a um, you have a lip. What kind of lip is that? Uh, eBay lip. It was forty dollars. But but it looks good, right? Pretty good, yeah. yeah. So the car rolls, it's pretty clean. I mean, considering, you know, um, what year is the car again? Uh, 1998. Nice. And then how, how? oh, on this side you can tell because of my driving, you can tell that it's a little bit higher, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why you're probably looking at it like that looks a little weird. Yeah. <laughs> um, so does this car come with this wing or is that something you installed? No, this car actually came with no wing and this also an eBay spoiler. And it was like $70, which is oh, nice. pretty good. So good deal. So so budget build, build a little bit, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it looks good though. You're doing good. Yeah. And then what kind of exhaust do you have? Uh, I'm not really sure. My dad actually picked up this exhaust and he just gave it to me. So your dad helps you out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. So let's check out the the trunk. Yeah. Let's see, you probably have a you have a mess in there or what? Nah. That <laughs> was a pretty clean. I actually took the seats out so that I put new speakers in because you need to take the plastics and off everything off to put those speakers. So you put those speakers on it and you yeah. took everything off? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you going to build like base or just something like so that sounds clean? No, no, it's just these wouldn't work. At all? It had the stock ones. Nice. So. so you're learning how to work on this car? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So you're going to put everything back? Yes. You like the tan interior? Mm, I'd prefer black to be honest. But it looks good though. So you gotta have your spare tire, make sure you got some air in it, right? Yeah. <laughs> and uh, you just put that strut bar on it too? Yes. What kind of strut bar is that? I'm not really sure, but the one I have in the front is uh, Megan Racing. Nice. So let's uh, let's check out the inside. So overall, what do we got going on here on the inside? Uh, the only thing, aftermarket stereo, uh, Pioneer, and like, these little, I don't know what you call these, but like, the little pedal, uh, yeah, like pedal uh, adapters, or, uh, yeah, adapters. Uh, that's about it. And this car has a sunroof too, right? Does the yeah. sunroof work? Yeah, that's pretty nice. I know when I wanted a car, um, this is this is a badass first car. This is your first car, right? Yeah, so yeah, yeah. must be nice. So pretty clean overall. It looks like you take good care of it. No cracks or nothing. That's no cracks on the on the dash. That's pretty good. It's nice. How many miles? Uh, 200,000, but the engine's still strong. Nice. Yeah. Well, cool. Power windows. Pretty much power. Pretty much is like your Honda Civic. It's a little bit more luxury. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. So let's check out the, uh, the engine. So nice, nice strut bar. Just has intake and Megan Racing strut bar. I was gonna put headers and stuff, but since I'm selling the car, it's not really worth anymore. What kind of engine is that? Which one does uh, it have? B18B. Oh, nice. Yeah. All so, stock. No, but it looks pretty good. So you still have, let's see, you did the valve cover? Yes. It looks nice. You redid that. The strut bar looks nice. The intake's pretty nice. Uh, it has, still has AC. Does it work? Uh, yes. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So why are you gonna sell it? What do you want to get? Um, to be honest, I'm probably gonna save up for like Nevo or something, and my parents are probably gonna help me on that. Nice. So you still got a, you're still going to school, right? Yeah, high school. Yeah. So high school. Uh, what year do you graduate? Uh, 2020. Nice. 2020. Yeah. So as you guys can see, guys, this car is pretty clean. You know, um, looks like he's gonna be selling it. Are you selling it anytime soon, or is it gonna be a while? Uh, probably next month. So wow, that yeah, soon. So. I see you got a radiator cap that reads your uh, sure. temperature. Yeah. Does it work? Yes. Nice. That's kind of, that's pretty smart, guys, to see that, especially with the heat. Has the car had any overheating issues or anything? No. That's just something to kind of keep yeah. an eye on. Nice. I mean, you do have the gauge inside, but that's just kind of uh, just in case, right? Yeah. So you can keep an eye on it. That's good. These are good little motors. Um, what are you going to sell the car for? To be honest, right now, I 
probably don't know. But next month, I'll probably have it on my Instagram. Okay, cool. Facebook and all that. Nice. So he's going to be selling it if uh, you guys are interested. Just um, follow him and then he'll be putting a price on his uh, Instagram. Yeah. Right? So he doesn't know yet. He's a little... He doesn't want to jump the gun right now. Yeah. <laughs> so anything else you want to point out on your car that you like? Um, um, if I would have kept the car, I probably would have gone J front. I like that a little more. So the JDM front end? Yeah. yeah, yeah. There's a kid on fa uh, Facebook right now selling his uh, JDM front end for like $800. I'm not gonna keep this up. <laughs> so, but it looks nice though. Overall, good job, you know. Good for you on your first car. I'm pretty sure you probably, when you go to school, you're probably one of the, are you a, a sophomore or uh, Junior. Junior. So, I don't know what kind of cars kids have in school now, but I'm assuming this is pretty, a pretty nice one yeah, versus yeah. the kids you go to school with. So that's good. Um, so you're from Carson City. Yeah. You came to Reno. Again, he has a, a YouTube and um, this is what he likes to do. He likes cars and he, he likes to vlog. And uh, he's very young guy, so he has a, his whole future ahead of him. And uh, hopefully, you know, he does good. Um, he's already doing good. and. Uh, keep pushing keep doing good thanks for that yeah. so th thank you for coming out here and um we're, we're gonna go for a drive on the car too <laughs> so we're gonna go for a drive guys we're gonna check it out see how it drives um again this car might be for sale so see how it handles all right guys so we're in the car with caesar um taking the target out for a drive it's a bumpy little car but you know what you pay for these cars nowadays it's um it's a great deal i mean this car's probably really good on gas right caesar yeah it is. but like how i drive it kind of <laughs> how much does it uh take to fill it up uh 30 dollars 30 bucks fills it up and then how long does it last you um uh, like i don't know to be honest. like a week because i only drive it around like my neighborhood since that way yeah. since i have my uh, permit only right now so so he does have his permit guys so you guys know uh he can ride with an adult technically or drive with an adult um he this is his first time out here on this side of town uh he's saying he likes it a little bit out here was it for you to learn how to drive stick? Well, I'm still kind of like getting better and better, but like practicing, but my dad really helped me out a lot, and so did my cousin, so. So your cousin you're with right now? Yeah, yeah. What's his name again? Uh, Wedo. He goes by Wedo, but his name is Miguel. Wedo. Miguel? Yeah. So it wasn't too hard for you to learn how to drive stick? Uh, no. Like, a week. Did you learn? Like a, did you learn on this car? Yeah. No. Actually, my dad's uh, 96. Uh, needs some pickup. He used to have. So. Nice. So that drives really nice. Have you ever raced this car? Uh, no. No. Uh, it's your baby, right? Yeah. yeah. Like if you if you mess it up, you can't go to school or something, right? <laughs> yeah. Did you already? Uh, did your school year end already? Or? Uh, yeah. Was it Friday or? I'm in summer vacation. Um, nice. Thursday. No, Wednesday. Wednesday. So he is on summer vacation. So he has the whole summer to play with. Must be nice. We, you guys remember when you guys were this young. So he's barely getting started. So the car drives pretty good. Um, you know, again, there's there's uh, Integra's out there. there. There's a lot of beat up ones. I mean, this one's fairly clean for the year that it is. Um, he's gonna, like I said, he, he said already he's gonna be selling it. Maybe. He's debating. He wants an Evo. What year Evo do you want? Uh, 2006. I've been looking at that. So, Evo straight on. So, an Evo 9? Yeah. Any any specific color you're looking for? Uh, probably white. White? Yeah. Nice. No, that's good. So, he wants a white Evo, guys. Um, if anybody out there knows somebody that has a decent, clean one, what are you looking to spend? How, mu how much money? To be honest, like 24 and down. So, so 24? If you, if you go with the 24,000? That would be very clean Evo, actually. Um, and then where, where do you work? Do you have a job or no? Uh, golf course. You work at a golf course? Yeah. What do you do there? Uh, just clean cards and take them to the people. Like, 
Oh, nice. Yeah. So you work at a golf course. Yeah. Do you get to play for free there? Or? Uh, no. Have you ever played golf? Like, no. No? No. Not yet? No. <laughs> it's not really a sport I'm interested in. Yeah. So you're just doing it to make the money right now? Yeah. Nice. Any plans for this summer? Anywhere you want to go or? Uh, just to be honest, YouTube videos and grow my channel. So, um, what's uh, you want to grow your channel on YouTube? Yeah. What do you want to focus on? What, what do you? What's going to be the main focus for you this this uh, summer? Buying a camera. And what, what kind of camera? Uh, the Canon camera. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice. And then uh, any car shows or events you want to go to? Or? Yeah. Uh, I go to streets and track a lot, and I'll probably be going to the ones around town. What, what is that? What's street to track? Uh, it's the Sacramento Raceway, and they sometimes do uh, two-step battles, limbo contests, uh, drag racing. And When's the next event? The 29th. Nice. Yeah. No, we're doing a collab uh, video here guys for you guys um he has again he has about 1300 subscribers got to meet caesar today which is pretty cool met his cousin Weddle, and uh, you know some nice people where's your family from uh like three hours from guadalajara in a place from called cotija michoacan cotija michoacan yeah so michigan baby i'm joking when i say that so he's from michoacan too that's where uh i'm from michoacan too so i guess i was talking to his cousin and we're very close very close to, uh, make sure you can there's a cut mark there. Uh, very close to uh, where I live in Mexico. Um, so it's pretty cool. You know, who would, who would have known? We're from the same place almost. We're probably like an hour and a half away from each other in Mexico. That is crazy. But I uh, hope you guys like this video, this review. He's going to be making a video too. Um, it's his first time uh, ever in the GTR, I think, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's what he's looking forward to. Right now, he's just kind of going through this video, wanting to get to his <laughs> video. So. So watch this video guys, thank you for, for watching and, and subscribing and, and backing us up on YouTube. Uh, again, we do, yeah, make a left and make sure you make a complete stop. Huh? Yeah. Um, we did have a cop back there guys, and uh, so we're just making sure that he follows uh, the laws of the road. <laughs> so um, thank you guys for watching the channel. Uh, I'm currently up to like 54 subscribers, it's not much, but I just got started and uh, it looks like it's heading out pretty good. Um, thank you Caesar for you know, coming over so we could do a vlog on uh, on your car. And again, he's just waiting to get to my house so he can do the the video on the GTR or get to ride in the GTR. That's what he's looking forward to. Yeah. You make a ride on the next street. Yeah. So, how do you feel about riding in a GTR? Uh, that's pretty sick because ever since the Fast and Furious came out, that's kind of like one of my biggest dreams, I guess. So, um, it's been his dream to ride in the GTR, and uh, we're almost there. We're just gonna wrap up this video for you guys and. Uh, all right, guys. So we just rode, um, you know, Caesar's uh, Integra. Really nice car for a first car. I wish I would have had something this nice when I was your age. Uh, but again, you work for it, so you deserve it. And um, look, again, he said he's gonna sell it. But overall, it's a nice car. Uh, he's not gonna really do much to it anymore. He plans on selling it within the next month, maybe. But he wants to get a white Evo. Um, so cool. Th thank you for coming over, Caesar. And uh, anything, um, anything you wanna say to the viewers? Uh, like and subscribe, I guess. <laughs> so, so you guys heard it like and subscribe um, you know help us out you know we, we do these videos for you guys uh, thank you thank you to all the subscribers and thank you for everybody that watches the videos you guys have a great day have a good uh, Sunday and enjoy the work week coming up thank you